New Berg. I'm gonna tell you about Map, map Incentive Day. So you got the arena back here, because that's what this is just like. It's like the big game day. It's like, it's like you're ready for map, you've done all this hard work, you've studied, you show up to the race and you go, nah, I'm not gonna do it. I'm good. I'm good. You show up to the you show up to the game and you go, nah, I'm not gonna do it. I, I don't really feel like it today. What? What? You've done everything, you've you've studied, you've worked hard, right? Show up. Okay, so you got a map incentive day. That means you're gonna go to the gym, have some fun. We'll talk about that in a minute. But all you gotta do to get that is grow one point. How do you get to go? Grow one point or score proficient or distinguished. That's Let's it. talk about that. On the day of March 30th, in advisory, you'll get banded, right? You'll go in, you'll listen to some music maybe, play some basketball, oh. play some play some Batman, volleyball, play Connect Four, maybe we'll have some other stuff, maybe some snacks, maybe some juice, you know? You can vibe out, listen to music, and chill. You can run around, be crazy, and play uh, basketball. Oh so, yeah, a little bit more specific here. So if you so, get your spring map cut scores, if you get proficient or distinguished, right? So in reading, for instance, if you get in sixth grade, 217, you're proficient, you're going. Seventh grade, 220, you're going. Eighth grade, 224, you're going. These numbers are if you're interested in distinguished. Math, you get 225 in sixth grade, you're going. 231, you're going. 236, you're going. Proficient or distinguished. Say you don't get proficient or distinguished. You don't need to do that. You don't need to, okay? All you gotta do is grow one point. So check out so this goals. Student. Check this out. All right, so look. Look, same thing we just said. 210, you just gotta go up to 211, right? This student grew a whole bunch. You can do that. That's effort. That's effort. That's a good night's sleep. All right, check it out. Then the next day, we go down a little bit, right? Maybe didn't get a good night's sleep. Maybe, you know what? These passages are too long. I don't want to read them. Read them, y'all. All you got to do, 210 to 211. You can do this. And look at that line right there, right? That's like the pool. You're going to pull yourself up out of the pool. Map says you can do this. Because here's what's for real, for real. 213, this is really your score. If I'm going to be honest real quick. And 217, map saying you can do that. But for the map incentive day, 210 to 211, and we got you. All this student has to do, got 210, all you got to do is go up to 211. That's it. Then I'm in the gym. I'm listening to music, vibing out, whatever, leave me alone. Or I'm playing basketball. Ah! Right? That's it. That's all you got to do. So what do you need to do on the 24th and 25th? First of all, you need to get a good night sleep, okay? Like, I'm wearing this IU for a reason. We lost by 29 points. I'm say 30. It was only 29. 29 points. Their flight didn't leave till 4 a.m. They get there. They're tired. They didn't even look like the same team. Now, we probably would have lost still, but it only would have been by 10. We lost by 29 points because they didn't get a good night's sleep. Tell me, that's what Miss O says, that uh, sleep is a superpower. And she's right. Get some sleep. It's going to make a huge, huge difference. Think about this uh, this spring forward, fall back, whatever. Think about that. Think about how you affected you all week and you felt like junk, right? Use the right word there, junk, right? So take that test on the 24th and 25th, Thursday and Friday. Have your butt in the seat and take the test, right? And you get reward day on 30th. All you got to do is grow one little point. You got this. Go.